Hey guys, it's episode 184. So it's been a while since I did my drawing videos, so I'm gonna try to get back on track with those. Um, I do have a slight cold, so don't mind me if I start coughing randomly, but usually in the morning or nighttime, it gets really bad. But during the afternoon, it seems to be slightly okay. So just a fair warning if you hear a lot of coughing, that's just me getting over my cold. So let's just start because I really want to start outlining this. Um, so I'm going on the hair first. I looked at a reference to do this drawing a little bit for the pose and I did copy a bit of the hair because I saw the hairstyle was really nice with the bangs so I wanted to kind of use it too and also the clothing was really nice so I did take that too but uh, I think it was an artwork done by someone else so it's not like I think it was just a piece of artwork done by someone I'm not sure if I will color it the same way. I did do some changing with the sleeves and stuff, so I didn't full-on copy it. So right now I'm just doing the hair. Um... I think the hair went through the eyes, so it's a bit odd. Because I usually don't do that, like the eyes go through the hair. But I like the style of it, so I really wanted to capture it. So now I'm doing the bangs. If I don't talk a lot during the video, I'm also trying to kind of save my voice a bit just because the cold. Sometimes if I talk for too long, it starts acting up and I start coughing more. So don't mind me. Okay, I'm going to turn it upside down for a bit just to get this part of the hair because it's at a weird angle for me. Sorry if it unfocuses. I'm trying to get it to focus. <clears throat> okay, so the hair is done and now I'm going to move on to the face. So the face outline is done, uh, I'm going to do the, I think I want to do the eyes first. Actually I'll do the face, the facial features last, so I'm just going to do the hand first. The hand was a bit difficult, I think, um, to get it the right way just because there was a lot of different 
because I normally, there are, sp I'm trying out like different hand poses and sometimes I'm not that good with how to make the hand and it's really difficult because um, sometimes I have to use my own hand to try to see how it's positioned and just put my hand in that position and see is it what would it look like and then I have to kind of see what would it look like in this other position like if it was the opposite way around like if I saw it in a mirror but unfortunately I don't have mirrors with me often so I tend to have to just make it up on the spot kind of see and translate it to the proper way that it's supposed to be like the angle and everything Now I'm working on the second part, this other side. I'm going to actually flip it over. Don't mind the weird angles, just trying to get everything. So, just going on the arm, the hand is cut off a bit because it's behind the other hand, so that's why it's like that. <clears throat> um, I think the hardest part for me was kind of focusing on the chest area. I was like... Okay, the arms are in words, so how do I get that, how do I show the chest area kind of like, how would the chest look if it was like that? Um, in the reference, it didn't look like there was much, so that was pretty good. Um, <clears throat> gonna do the bottom of this coat. You'll notice on the sides I didn't finish some of the hair outlining because I forgot, but I will finish it. I think it's more of... I struggle with the chest area because normally when I draw poses, the character's chest is normally, like, shown, so the arms are a bit either spread out or in, like, they're straight, so they're not close together, and then the chest area is just shown normally, so that's how I got confused a bit on how to do the chest area, so I kind of had to learn, like, what was a good angle to show and how to show it. Just doing the detailing of the inside shirt thing. And this is the belt. OK, 
Okay. And the rest of the design is down here. Okay. Um, now I'm going to do the scarf. So the reason why I haven't been doing much of the drawings, I think I explained this in one video, but I didn't really explain it well. <clears throat> um, basically, because I started college, it's a bit difficult because it takes around like two hours to get home. And with that in mind, I kind of get sleepy on the bus for some reason when I'm just going home or from anywhere in general on the bus I get sleepy and it's not good because I get <clears throat> too sleepy and then it's like try me trying to stay like trying to get home okay <clears throat> but then not only that I think also because I get sleepy, I come home late, and then I'm like, I'm even more exhausted because I just came home. And when I go on my bed, it's more relaxing. And it's not relaxing to do anything else when, like, you're tired. So I'm like, I want to do the drawing videos, but then I can't because it feels like I'm going to doze off and my eyes start getting stingy because... You know, I wake up pretty early, like 6 every morning, even though I don't need to. But I do it anyways just to get my body used to that. Because I used to wake up that early. Um, and then in high school, I woke up at 7. So I got used to waking up at like 7 or 8-ish. And then <clears throat> in high school, I learned like you don't need to go like so early because we live like 15 minutes walk or a 10 minute walk and I was like okay don't need to wake up that early and then I got used to waking up at like 8 o'clock and afterwards it was just me waking up not so early now I'm gonna do the outline the beagle ears this is a beagle dog ear thing um so yeah and now when I wake up in the morning that early, I'm like, I'll get up, but I feel like, <clears throat> my body has a reaction to when I wake up early. It's like, if for those of you who might know, if you wake up early and your, your throat starts gagging because of mucus and build up, and you're like, you feel like you're about to every time you cough you feel like you need to um get rid of mucus but because my throat is weird I tried to cough out mu mucus once but it didn't work so it's always stuck in my throat in the morning so it's really bad and then it looks like I'm gonna throw up so it's pretty bad but I need to get used to it. That's why I wake up so early. But that gives me less energy through the night time to do things like videos. So I try to do them even though I feel tired. Today I don't have school so it's fine. So now I'm going to go through the ears. Sorry if I talk too much about... Sorry for those of you who don't like nasty stuff like mucus like talking about it but yeah that's basically why so so i when i get home i'm pretty tired and then i can't really focus too much on anything that takes up so much energy but i really do want to make these videos so i'm trying Ok, 
Okay, if you guys can't see a lot of this outlining on the eyes, because my hand's blocking, sorry. You'll notice that um, I usually don't draw the eyes or the eyebrows through the eyes because cutting off seems weird to me. I feel like it's unrealistic, so I want to do like realistic proportions and stuff, so I try not to. But for this time, I was like, I want to make like these really nice eyes, so I wanted to do that. Originally, I was going to do like realistic anime eyes like really realistic but then it didn't look good so I couldn't get the right proportion so I decided to stick with these ones so I made them like bigger than usual and they looked really nice okay here is the overview. I hope you like this video. If you like my video, please like and subscribe if you haven't, if you want to, that is. Um, there's another drawing that goes with this as for Bunny Lord, which is my friend. So he will, um, so I will outline that one next. Um, he is a part, for those of you uh, who follow me on Facebook, you might have seen him post only once. Um, he kind of lost a bunch of pictures on his old phone that he was going to post, and then when he got home from Hong Kong during summer, his phone died, randomly just started glitching, and then it died. So he had to use an older phone, but it's and then he got a plan for that, like a slight plan for that. But that's why he hasn't posted a lot. He is a part of my Facebook page now. I did give him the information for my Twitter. But he doesn't really have that much to post right now. I'm hoping in the future that he can. Just because I want it to be like a variety of things posted. So yeah. So my next video will be outlining the other drawing that pairs with this one. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye!